digital purchase order. This is a quick introduction to how to set up approval levels. This is quite important because sending purchase orders manually from one person to the other to get to a final approval would be very time consuming. Instead, you can automate your approval chain in DPO. To get started, please go to the admin section and select the tab Approval Levels. Here, you can define how many approval steps you will need. In this demo, we have three approval steps, but you can have fewer or more depending upon your own requirements. For each approval level, you can also decide whether this should apply to all purchase orders or to a certain minimum or maximum amount. Level 3, for example, applies to POs larger than 5,000 US dollars. You can change this filter to apply to POs less than 5,000 US dollars. Level 2 has a different setup. Here we have checked the box Approval by Department Only. What does this mean? Let me show you an example table. As you can see, on level 1, we have assigned multiple approvers to the same level. If approvers are responsible only for certain departments, you can set up the approval chain separately for each department. That way, each approver will only be able to validate POs from their own departments. If this meets your needs, simply check the box Approval by Department Only for each relevant approval level. Last but not least, you can define whether the purchase order ID should be hidden or not for each level. If you want to hide purchase order IDs for declined purchase orders, please click the corresponding box at the top. Once we have finalized the approval level structure, the approvals are all that is missing from a completely automated approval chain. You can either assign them in the next tab, Users, or click directly on the user icon on each approval level. That way, you can assign each user to the corresponding approval directly. If you have further questions, please send us an email at support at digitalpurchaseorder.com or give us a call at 1-888-376-7254. We can also arrange a demo appointment with you. Simply contact us via email and we will schedule a call at your earliest convenience. We hope you enjoyed this video. Please also check our other video tutorials on the main tutorial page.